the man, the myth, the legend himself, Klaus is in with Queen Charge, Royal Ghost. Let's go. The man, the myth, the legend, Klaus himself is in with five golems and 13 party wizards? Bro, it's a three star. Klaus, you dirty dog. That is so cool. Three, two, one. Yes, Klaus just barched Tribe Gaming's base. Let's go. <laughs> Klaus with the third attack for Queen Walkers coming in with, oh my gosh, he's going for the meme army. Yes, Klaus, I love you. The man, the myth, the legend himself, Klaus is in with Queen Charge, Royal Ghosts. Let's go. How's he gonna do it? <coughs> Queen starting over here on the left side of the base. We're gonna rage her up. Ooh, we're gonna go with the freeze as well. Kill the enemy queen. Okay, wall break her in toward the multi. He's got healers on the queen. He brought 20 royal ghosts. Already used one to funnel. Nice. Queen gonna step inside. Down goes the multi. We got a partial CC pool from the Coco Loon. Just a handful of archers so far. There goes the rage on the queen. Ooh, rocket loons. He's gonna go with the freeze. Poison for the super minions. Perfectly done so far from Klaus. King. Grand Warden on ground. Log launcher for the queen. Royal champion on the left as well. Here we go. Yes, sir. Another wall break over there for the king to continue on into the royal champion compartment. <laughs> Royal Ghost to help funnel the queen. This is basically like the log launcher, queen charge, triple hero kill squad, the other side of the base and rocket loon, whatever's left over, except instead of rocket loons, he's bringing Royal Ghost. But it's basically the same concept, it looks like. Healer switch to the Royal Champion. No, no, that's not good news. Dragon Rider takes out the scatter. Queen's still alive. Healers go back to the queen. Hello? Uh, some of them do. Bro, this is getting sketchy. Rage up the healers, rage up the queen. She's gonna get the town hall. Invisibility spell for the rescue. Thank goodness. King, how did the warden die, bro? He's the best golem in the game. He must have gotten out in front. LOL. Town hall drops. Royal champion still alive. We got a freeze and an invis. He's got, bro, he's got so many royal ghosts left over. His base is wrecked. Holy crap. He's gonna swag seven royal ghosts and two spells. Sir, that should be illegal. Down goes the king. Seven royal ghosts for the last trash building. <laughs> and it's a crushed base all day long. The man, the myth, the legend, Klaus himself is in with a Lalo attack, with a jump spell and six invisibilities. Here we go. What is he gonna be able to do? Some balloons on the top side, okay. With the blimp. Is it for the eagle? And eh, where does he want it? Yes, it is for the eagle. Oh, is it a blizzard? <gasps> it is. Wait, giants? What? Super wizards? Okay. Giants with super wizards for your blizzards now, ladies and gentlemen. That is the meta, LOL. <laughs> oh, we still got one alive. Can we snipe the Tesla? Yes, we do. Oh, okay. Snipes the Tesla. Wall breaks at 12 o'clock. There's still one headhunter and the lava dog up there. Another wall breaker at 11. He still has a third wall breaker, bro. How many wall breakers do you need? And a jump spell? Oh, dude. He's going to put the warden on ground again. I can already smell it. He's going to put the warden on ground and do something dirty. I think. Let's see. King and queen and warden are going to go in from the 12 to 11 side. RC from 9. And he's going to wall break all the way to the core and jump to the town hall. I'm calling it. He's going to jump to the town hall. Yep, there goes the warden on ground. He's doing it. He's going for the dirty, just suey the whole base. Clean up Lalo for the back end. <sighs> it's ballsy, but they need something ballsy right now to triple. Two golems with the queen and the warden. He's sending king on the outside. Okay. And the wall breakers for the king to get into the scatter. Oh, I guess if he drops the jump into the alley, queen will still be able to reach the town hall. Okay, I like it. Hopefully this is going to work out. The golems are dying fast though. So we had to invest the free spell just to keep them alive. That queen is doing a lot of damage. RC in with the king. Giant on the outside to tank for the funnel wizard. We're going to need the jump spell soon. There goes the jump. 
Okay, that's gonna work. That's gonna force Queen to eventually target the Town Hall. I like it. Balloons on the outside to grab the defenses that the Royal Champion's missing. Bro, he's just gonna try to sui the whole base. There goes the Warden ability to keep the King alive a little bit longer. He got all four heroes in that Warden ability. Down goes the Multi. Oh, Queen, you better not get distracted by this King. <gasps> okay, she takes the jump. Yes! The Yak beats through another wall. <clears throat> Invis for the Queen and the King. She takes the jump. Here we go. The Lalo's in from three with the freeze. Where's the next Invis? Queen still has her ability. Down goes the Town Hall. Hello, Tornado Trap on the back end. He just suing the whole base. 80% and the heroes are still alive. Klaus, you dirty dog. RC ability. She stays alive. The Queen stays alive. The Warden dies to the orange juice as usual, bro. That's his favorite drink. And the Queen with one HP. She's invincible, dude. The Queen Sui that does not end. It's a three star for Klaus who literally just sueyed the entire base. Holy crap. And both teams are four for four. The man, the myth, the legend, Klaus himself is in with five golems and 13 party wizards. Bro, this man's watched Nick's golem avalanche in the duo master series and was like, <laughs> I can do that too. <laughs> Oh, baby. Let's see how he's going to do it. He's got three invis, a jump spell, a quake. The heck is he going to use a quake for, bro? Is he doing a skelly donut? He is. Oh, my gosh. He's going for the early skelly donut first. This is going to be awesome. Come on. Tell me it works. Tell me it works. He's got nine super wall breakers. How did I not notice that? Nine wall breakers. He gets the clan castle. He gets the scatter shot, bro. He's going to wall break the whole base. And then swag the jump. He sends the king in early. Sui king for the queen, the multi. Okay, we're going to invest a freeze as well. First golem is in on the right side of the base. Bro, I swear. Gaku, Stadra, and Klaus are just fighting for the thumbnail today. <laughs> they don't even care about winning the money here in this match. They just straight up want the thumbnail. This is phenomenal. First golem's about to die. So we're going to drop the second golem. Ground warden to help support. We don't have any defensive CC troops to worry about. We can just slowly golem walk around the entire base. He's got a battle blimp activated. Here come the rest of the golems all spread out across the bottom of the base. Lots of party wizards. One headhunter to help get through the enemy king. Nice. Queen and warden just slowly making their way through each and every compartment, bro. He's got wall breaker after wall breaker after wall breaker after wall breaker. Look at all this wall breaking, dude. Oh my gosh. He gets through the whole base with wall breakers. Then he's got the jump spell for the back end. This is awesome. He still has a royal champion to use. Queen's still alive. He's going to blimp the town hall just to be safe. Lol. I bet he could have even used a stone slammer if he wanted. I mean, like a siege barracks or something cool from 9 o'clock. Pretty sure the queen could have taken out the town hall. There goes the blimp. It does get there with the quake as well. Hello, tornado trap. Uh-oh. He's got the jump. Yeah, I'm surprised he blimped the town hall if he's going to jump there anyway. Oh, well. Down goes the town hall. We got the Royal Champion in the left side of the base. Still two free spells to go. Bro, the Queen's still alive. She's going to step inside the Giga Juice of Death, though. Royal Champion already used her ability, but we do have two freezes. Can keep her alive. We're going to double freeze. It's a three star. Klaus, you dirty dog. That is so cool. Beautiful creative attack against the Moon's base. And Queen Walkers with another three star. Their only fail was a 99% time fail. The man, the myth, the legend, Klaus is in again with 150 Barch troops. What? Bro, with nine hogs, 12 sneakies, five zaps and a quake, he's about to try to Barch the heck out of this base. Please tell me it works. Woo. This is about to get spicy. King over here with a wall breaker. Going in for the Archer Queen. Okay. With his ability, there goes a Zap Quake in the core. No Skelly Trap to stop the King. He should be able to clear most of that compartment. Bro, Klaus, what are you doing? Klaus. Klaus. What are you, what are you doing? Use the rest of the Zaps. Oh, my anxiety. I thought the Builder was going to go repair the Inferno Tower for a second. Okay. Inferno Tower goes down. Triple Ice Golem CC comes out. He's going to have to deal with that. Sure. 
archer at six o'clock. We gotta pull the triple ice golem down. Oh, we got another archer over here as well. There is a poison spell. What are we gonna use? We're gonna use Barch to kill ice golems. <laughs> okay, why not? They're gonna stall. They're gonna at least keep them sitting there for a while. RC is in from the bottom side of the base. Queen to walk from like seven to the left. Sure. The Barch to kill the ice golems is actually super effective. Ground warden with the queen. Golem is in. Wall break. Barch is making its way in from the left side of the base. RC is gonna grab the scatter shot. Queen is tanking the scatter, which actually works out in this situation because she should get healed back up by the unicorn. I like it. There's a giant bomb. Luckily, the golem pops the double giant bomb. We're going to pop that warden ability. Just keep all these barge troops alive through the eagle, through some of the traps, through the multi targeting inferno tower. We might have to freeze it up here unless he just wants to let the barge troops die. RC is in the core. Now she's going to make her way to the left. We're trying to sneak eat the town hall at the same time. He's multitasking. He's multitasking. We still have a Siege Barracks. We still have nine hogs. There goes the RC ability. Queen is at full health again. Still trying to sneaky that Town Hall. Their storage is in the way. We got the jump spell to help the Queen. We switch to a Log Launcher to take out the Scatter Shot. Here come the Sneakies for the Town Hall. We got five more and an Invis. Oh no, Klaus. Oh no, Klaus! He sent them the wrong way! It Tornado Trap! The Town Hall stays up! Queen has her ability, but she's not going there. Oh, oh, pop the ability. Down goes the real warden. Queen, she gets the town hall. Let's go. Oh, no. We got hogs. We got Barch. Bro, tell me he recovers. 32 seconds, and there's buildings in the core. It's going to be another time, Phil. For real. Here come all the hogs. The wizard tower needs to drop. Queen is dodging the giga poison like a boss. Down goes the bomb tower. Down goes the X bow. We got barbs trying to break through a wall, but I don't know if they're going to get there in time. <clears throat> Queen can reach the gold storage. 13 seconds to go. All the defenses are dead. Down goes the gold storage. Don't you dare be another 99. Come on, hogs. Just two swings. Three, two, one. Yes! Klaus just barched Tribe Gaming's base. Let's go. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Klaus with the third attack for Queen Walker is coming in with, oh my gosh. He's going for the meme army. Yes, Klaus, I love you. He's using one of everything. He has five healers though. Oh my gosh. What is he gonna do to Crazy Ryan's base? No freaking way. $200 for his team on the line and he says, hold up guys, let me go for the meme army. I want that $50 bonus. <laughs> King on the bottom side of the base. Queen at five o'clock. He's gonna funnel King into the multi-target Inferno Tower Chamber. Queen's gonna walk from five into the Eagle Artillery Compartment, it looks like, okay. King pops ability, finds the Tesla farm though. That might stall the King up. Double Giant Bomb kills all his barbs. He still takes out the multi though. The level 80 King is just unstoppable, especially with the Yak. Balloon and Archer and Barbarian to funnel the Mortar over at 4.30. Double Ice Golem coming out of the CC. Probably going to see a third one in there, but it didn't get pulled, so we're going to have to deal with them separately. Rage Spell and no Poison Drop just yet. He's going to save it, because you never know. There could be Headhunters or something else in that CC. Wall Break to the core. It is indeed a third Ice Golem. Skelly Trap activates. Queen's going to be able to take that out in just a second. Eagle Artillery's not yet activated. She should take it out before it activates. And he still has, like, one of literally every other troop in the game. It's going to be so interesting to see how he uses it. Minute and 55 left on the clock. Third Ice Golem pops, stalls up the queen even longer. Even if he does triple here, it's gonna take a lot of time. We might be close on time. Sends the Royal Champion with that new Rogue Queen skin and the Lassie on the right side of the base. Wizard behind to help funnel queen all the way to the core. Royal Champion's gonna grab several defenses. A second Skelly stalls up the queen for even longer. We're gonna poison the enemy queen. That's actually a really good call. It's a good thing he didn't use it earlier. A third Skeleton Trap pops. Makes his RC invisible. A fourth skeleton trap pops. He found all four. Down goes the enemy queen. Does he have another invisibility spell to keep this RC alive through the scatter? He does. Does he use it? Oh, no. And very smartly, she gets it anyway. Down goes the scatter. Queen goes to the core. Baby dragon to funnel the right side. Blimp for the town hall. Does he get there? Is there a tornado trap? 
no tornado with the rage spell blimp takes out the town hall he's queen charging the entire base golem with a pekka and one two three four five maybe 69 witches from the top side of the base with the warden rage in the core invisibility for the queen and a skeleton spell queen had to pop her ability i think she got locked onto by the single she almost gets through the king ends up having to beat through a wall switches targets to the bomb tower what the heck is she doing? Now she goes back for the wall again. We still got two freezes. A hog rider from 9 o'clock. Dude, no way. If this triples, this is going to be phenomenal. A Valkyrie at 130 takes out the warden. <clears throat> a hog rider and a minion from 9 o'clock. They die right away. Rip. Queen finds a tornado in the core. 20 seconds to go. It's going to be another time fail with the meme army. Or is it? He pops the warden ability. But Queen has to beat through a wall. 12, 11, 10, 9... Double freeze. If only they were haste spells or something. 94%. 95. 96. And he runs out of time with the Noah's Ark army. Klaus! You are incredible, my friend. Wow, that was awesome to see. But not gonna be enough to triple Crazy Ryan's base. And now, Space Station have a chance to win this match if they triple out.